Hello. Yes, we got it. Yes, we got it. We got a chief thing, boys and girls, ladies and gentlemen. First time my account after 27,859 games have a clan reward tank. This is chief thing. Yes, I know. I got M60 and one one b but they are, you can get those for, from the bone shop. So I don't even count them as a clan war reward tanks. But yeah, we got it. We got a chief thing. It was really hard work. Trust me, guys, it was really super hard work to get the Chieftain. Why? Because we were playing two weeks on the Clan Wars. Two weeks Clan Wars. Day by day, for four, five, or even six hours of the Clan Wars. It was amazing. It was difficult and amazing. And boring in the meanwhile. Obviously, we were up, have uh, many different choices to change, to take the uh, tank, but we choose Chieftain. Because you never know when the next time you're going to get the Chieftain. Then we also had some more uh, fame points. So we took uh, 3D camo. We took a little bit different camos. We took female crew, uh, other camos, some experience and bonds. And in total, we managed to earn over 3,300 or 3,400 fame points. And the tank was costing almost 3.7 thousand fame points. And yeah, we got it. We finally got it. Beautiful. I can tell you guys, the Sandy Clan, the Polish Sandy Clan, I'm not Polish overall, but guys, our clan is not super like unicums, like obviously there is a fame or whatever, we're not comparing with them, yeah, we are, we, we are not like them, yeah, but trust me, the clan overall is really strong, can work really well as a team, and can be really super competitive, in a clan activity, our LO is 1.1 thousand only, and that's not really super great, let's say like that, our win ratio, I don't know, is that an average per person, or an average overall the clan, it's 48 or 49, but I think so, this is the our win ratio, as you can see, this is this 50%, maybe, I don't know how it works, I don't know, this 28, 28, Less than 28 days, so we got 48 win ratio, yeah? It's nothing really super amazing, but in meanwhile, the clan, what they show in the clan activity when we were trying to fight for a tank, you don't want to know, guys. We were dominating. We were in, in a couple of days, we were in the top 20 U clans. We were on top 12 position, 12, 15. But, but we ended up with 74 position. Which is amazing. Obviously, we could be way, way higher. Why? Because on the last day, we failed. We get four penalties. With, if I'm not mistaken, it cost for us 20,000 fame points. So we could have way more fame points and way more everything. So as you can see, still 74. 74 plays in Sandy is beautiful. We got times five bonds and 33,000 gold. And that's, I think, so really fair and re really beautiful position, in my opinion. And uh, talking about the players, uh, I finish as a single player in the 506 position, which is high as well. We managed to do that. And uh, overall, talking about uh, talking about my uh, teammates, my clan mates, 28 per 28 people, 28 persons. 28 of us managed to get the tank, which is a lot. We had the four, five, or even six teams, and uh, I would say that's a lot. And once again, I'm going to highlight, we are not competitive clan, we're not super unicums or super fluffy ones, but we managed to be the really strong clans. We managed to be really strong clans, and we managed to get 28 tanks, 28 chieftains, let's say like that. Or those three guys could have it, as well and would be 31 but this this clan wars was really difficult like different than it used to be yeah keep that in mind also some of the people probably gonna get the shift in just for betting the with the bonds or some other tank let's say like that anyway let's jump to the battles and let's see what kind of battles we actually had and how did we deal with it let's go so, 
What do you see wrong in this game? <laughs> That's one more my clan war game in Himmelsdorf with Object 279. What do you see wrong in this one? Yeah, you know guys, I'm playing uh, marking tanks without gold. And in this case, as you can see, I'm playing without gold in 279. Against all those HP boosted E100s or, 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 or 60 TPs. I'm playing without gold, guys. And we're lagging really well. Sorry about that. Is it going to be dodgy to win? We got one penetration so far out of three shots. But I'm not counting those other shots. We got two. We're doing it. It's going well, isn't it? Three. Enemy got VK and mouses and E100s with um, with 60 DPS and all of them have a HP boost. We have a really difficult situation to win the game. Why? Because they have HP boosts. Yeah, and we need time to farm them out, which is really difficult. Trust me, it's really difficult. So, and then we got GP as well in 279 without gold. I don't think so, it was smart. Obviously, we did mistake by going to the battle without gold. Hey, everyone doing mistakes, yeah? And as you can see, it's 3 to 5. It's difficult to farm. We're getting ammo rock. We double track someone, which is good. We are able to give one more shot. I think so. E100 playing with the big gun. I would do the same thing, to be fair. I would try to do the same thing. I would play with the big gun as well. That was a bad shot. I wouldn't. I won't even penetrate him. Even I would hit correctly. Anyway, it's quite hilarious that I'm playing without gold against them and actually it's, to be fair, if, you, if you're having attention, uh, it's working out. Let's a little bit skip and let's see what's gonna be the end. Machine Boom! Destroyed. We've been destroyed. We've been last one and they destroyed us. 5.4 thousand. Here you go, without gold, we lost the game. So, guys, I want to show you this battle. This is the first battle, which one I want to show you. One from the clan war battle. Why I want to show you that? Because this is an example of what to not do while you're having a party. Okay? It was, f I guess, not funny for my teammates, but for me it was quite funny, I guess. In that day, in that evening, I did three battles with my clanmates. And as you can see, I'm on the last one. I'm still in the spawn. And um, uh, my team, one flank went to the left, another one to the right. Yeah, yeah. And as you can see, I'm traveling. Doing my, my stuff. As you can see, I'm playing weird. I'm trying straight. I don't know where I'm going. Okay, I wake up. And here we go. We got one flank, which is perfect. We actually boom, 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 swapping the shells. And uh, yeah, as you can see, enemy most of the enemy is not spotted. So what does that mean? Probably they're sitting in the red line over here, holding the positions. And we're spotting one, two tanks. Good. We're getting tracked. We're shooting one. Mm -hmm. We're not fixing our tracks. We're still standing in this position. I think so. It's quite dangerous position. Why is it quite dangerous position? As you can see, my my aim is really smooth. Huh? We're getting penetrated. I think so. This position is quite good for me because of the angle. But I forgot that there can be some dudes on the right side. And we figured it out where is the most of enemy. We lost some hit points, which is not great. And <laughs> so far, zero penetration. There can be already like two, three thousand damage, apparently, you know. And... Map control is quite good. We have one side, they're holding another one. It's quite difficult for our heavies to push on this flank because of the bridge lines over there. Yeah, We're holding it. We're thinking. That's how we were playing. I just want to show you this one battle, how it was and how it was looking like. Because in my opinion, this battle was really good. Like OP, one of the kind. I don't know what the hell I'm, uh, what I was doing at this moment, but I didn't do really well, as you can see. Are we going to do something? 
So, let's go to do something. And this is the battle beginning. Beginning again in the same bush. Trying to outspot some enemies. Giving one. Finally, we're getting ammo. Boom! Don't play Clan Wars when you're drunk. <laughs> Your reaction is really low. Yeah? <laughs> really well. Who? No one is not protected from Amarok, yeah? <laughs> All right. And yeah, that was Clan War re re Review. And that's what we had. And that's how we played in the Clan Wars. And we got beautiful chieftain in our garage. And that was a Sandy. Feel free, guys, to check it out. And feel free to join the Sandy Clan. The Sandy, if I'm not mistaken, have an um, extra one or two clans which calls cindy if i'm not mistaken and something else if i'm right if i'm right anyway and as you can see even statistically people thinking the clan is bad but overall we can beat the ass and we can win really well we can win really well guys honestly we managed to get 28 tanks keep that in mind thank you for watching and see you soon